Hello friends, this is Dr. Barasat Chinde. Today, we are going to learn very important topic, preposition. Pre means before, position means place. The particular word preposition is a word placed before a noun or pronoun to show in what relation the person or thing denoted by it stands in regard to something else. In another word, a preposition is a word that is kept before the object and gives relation between adjective and noun, verb and noun, and noun and noun. Friends, see the example. I am on the car. I am in the car. I am at the car. Means I have used various prepositions on, in, at. All these prepositions are shows position or place of the particular words. So that's why the whole example is same, but due to the different preposition, meaning is different. That's why today we are going to learn preposition of place. In the particular preposition of place, there is a on, in, at, and by prepositions are. See the use of in preposition. In preposition is used to show containers, enclosed spaces. For example, I have money in my pocket. There is nothing left in my glass. I am in the bus. The particular examples show enclosed spaces or containers. So, this is use of in preposition. In is used in areas, regions and cities. For example, Kachner is a small village in Satara mountain. We are going for trekking in the country. Lots of people were swimming in the sea. In is used in liquids, other substances also. For example, there is lots of sugar in the tea. There is milk in your coffee. In is used in buildings, rooms also. For example, I am in the kitchen. Now forget my book in your office. We are playing in the park. In groups of people, in is used. For example, he works in the bank. He plays in national team. Then, on preposition, on is used in flat surfaces. For example, the Reliance market is on the Kalda corner. The best price is on the corner of Itkeda. On is used to show surfaces. The book is on the table. My pen is on the desk. We live on the third floor. Do not write on question paper. On is used in oceans, rivers, lake also. For example, Agra is a town on the Yamuna. Petrol is on the water. We will take on the lake. Then at preposition, at is used for addresses. For example, I live at 305 Python Road. We have meeting at Radha's house. At is used in specific places, points in space. For example, she is at school. He will meet me at bus stop. Turn left at the traffic light. At is used in events. For example, we will meet at a birth birthday. He will speak at the conference. Then by preposition, by is used next something beside or near. For example, we are waiting by bus. Put your bag by the door. He live near the college. He live Next the college, he live by the school. There are some exceptions. See the example. It's on the corner. It's at the corner. Your seat is on the right side. I saw 
in the corner on the paper at is used to show specific times on the clock or points of time in the day in is used periods of time on is used with the dates and named days of the week at is used to show specific times clock times for example the conference will start at 10:30 at is used to show specific times day meal times for example she doesn't like cooking at night we will go shopping at night in the morning in the afternoon in the evening at night she is busy at present in is used with longer periods of time for example i was born in 1980 she will visit us in january see the example he shouted at me he shouted to me what is difference between first and second sentence first sentence shows target point of view means he shouted intensely purposely to me in the first sentence there is a target point and in second sentence he shouted to me means it is a example of direction point then next example he works at the post office he works in the post office in the first sentence shows place exact location in the second sentence he works in the particular building the next he threw the ball at me he threw the ball to me in the first sentence there is a target point of view and second sentence direction point of view means he tried to me he tried for me to catch next example i was born in this village i was born at this village the difference between both sentences in the first sentence village is big second sentence village is small the next he studies at oxford he lives in oxford means in the first sentence oxford is university second sentence oxford is the particular city then next peter shouted at me peter shouted to me in the first sentence suggest that peter was angry with me and in second sentence peter suggest that he was trying to communicate with me at a distance these are examples regarding at to into example he jumped into the river she ran towards the station he went across the river above the picture is above the mantelpiece below the mantelpiece is below the picture the bus is in front of the car behind the car is behind the bus see the next preposition up example i walk up and down the platform up and down here express the notion of along and need not have any vertical implic implications across they drew across the frontier he took a walk across the field along we walked along the river bank towards i walked backwards towards the door into come into the house she divide into the water through they walked slowly through the woods out of he decided to get out of teaching away from the red ball is rolling away from the blue box welcome to my video channel welcome for my video channel see the bit, see the difference between both sentence correct one is 
welcome to my video channel. So, uses of two, two is used for direction. Example, I usually take a bus to school. Second one, two is used for time between two points. Example, it's half to two. Number three, two is used for preferences. Example, do you prefer what to take a bus? And fourth use of two is limit end point. Example, the water came up to my neck. These are uses of two. Then, uses of for. For is used for period of time, often with present participle. Use of something benefits helping someone. Uses of for, for is duration, benefits, asking someone a favor and function. For example, reading a book is good for your brain. I am going to travel similar for enjoying. See the example, sleeping enough is good for your health. It is example of benefits and use of for. Then duration, public period of time. I have been learning English for one month. It is a period of time. It is duration of time. Helping someone. Can you see the next example? My sister brought a dinner to me. In the particular sentence, to me is a destination. My boss brought lunch for me. In the particular sentence, for is used for to help. Next example, I made a quick phone call to my mom. To my mom is the destination. I made a quick phone call for my mom. In the second sentence, it is used for help. Common collocations. Collocations means when words are often together in a sentence. For example, he is calling to apologize for missing the meeting yesterday. He should apologize to his boss for missing yesterday. Travel plus for purpose of time. I am applying for a scholarship. See the usage of for and since. For is used with periods of time to show the duration of an action. It is mostly used with perfect continuous tense through it may be found with other tenses as well. For, a, for example, the child has been sleeping for three hours. And next, since. Since marks the point of time at which an action began. It is used only if the action has continued till the time of speaking. Hence, it's found with perfect continuous tense. For example, she has been teaching in this college since 1980. Previous question paper and its solution. Question number one, I was dash my regular walk through the forest dash 9 a.m. The question was in March 2014. Second, Nasik City recorded 52.7 mm rain dash the 4 hours dash 3.30 pm and 7.30 pm on Friday. Fill in the blanks with suitable preposition. The particular question was in February 2020. Third, they stood dash silence 
as a mark dash honor to her in bracket fill in the blanks with suitable preposition the particular question was in 2017 march fourth meet me dash 10:30 am dash monday in bracket fill in the blanks with suitable prepositions the question was in july 2016 next in a meeting the physical teachers decided to spend 2 hours dash the players playground dash warm up activities fill in the blanks with proper prepositions the question was in october 2015 next the police dash monday are stayed sorry the police dash monday arrested five men dash cheating city businessmen in bracket fill in the blanks with suitable preposition the question was in march 2015 next the lady took the girls dash a hall where they met a few more girls who were waiting dash her instructions fill in the blanks with suitable preposition the question was in october 2014